Hello everybody, here we are once again with John Collins. Short demonstration using the QTEC KT65 in conjunction with QTEC Instruments. Doing a quick test on earth electrode testing using the free wire method. Okay, so what we've done is we've got an electrode here that's under test. We've measured it, it's 1.2 meters. So one meter in the ground. And what we've done is with our two lines run out, our C2 and our P2, our potential and our current lines, with our temporary spikes, we've placed them out at the right positions. It's as simple as this. You put the lead into the back ports, which are colour coded, so it's no problem at all there. And when you turn the test around, as you can see there, I'll just put the back light on for you, it's on the earth setting. Now we have to take three readings, so what I simply do, push and twist, and I take my first measurement. Wait for the reading to stabilise, push and twist back, and I've got a value of 0.79 and I make a note of that reading. What we do now, we do our second reading and we'll simply take out our temporary spike P2, potential to, place it in the ground and take our second reading to guidance note three. And as you can see there, slightly increased because it's gone further away and we've got a value of 1.0. Let's stabilize seven. And that's my second reading. I now take my third and final reading which is where I bring it back to its original position and then 10%, in this case one metre, closer, push and twist. And for my final reading there, we've got a value of 0.73. And it's a simple case now, is adding the three up and dividing by three for our calculation to guidance note three. This is just a simulated test, so we're not too concerned about the values. It's just a shade how to use it using your KT65. And there you have it. Earth electrode testing with your KT65. Remember folks, Johnny Ace, he's on the case.